गाइज आई एम प्रियंका वेलकम बैक टू माई किचन वंस अगेन टूडे आई बी शोइंग यू ऑल हाउ टू प्रिपेयर कंडेंस मिल्क एट होम कंडेंस मिल्क इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इन्ग्रीडियंट वाइल मेकिंग एनी डेजर्ट बीट खीर केक पुडिंग एंड मेनी अदर्स देर आर टू रीजन्स वाई आई प्रेफर दिस रेसिपी बिकॉज फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल इट्स कॉस्ट इफेक्टिव एंड सेकेंडली इट्स फ्रेश बिकॉज इट्स होम मेड एंड ऑल्सो विदाउट एनी प्रेजर्वेटिव लाइक दी मार्केट वंस It's a very easy recipe with very few ingredients. So let's quickly start. So we will need half a liter of whole milk, one cup of granulated sugar, and one tablespoon of butter. So here I have taken a heavy bottom pan, and to this I'm going to add the milk and the sugar. We'll give it a mix, and I'm going to cook it on a high flame unless it gets a boil. we'll continuously stir it otherwise it is going to stick into the bottom and will burn as you can see that it has come to a boil i'm going to put my flame on medium and i'm going to cook it and continuously stir it we have to cook it unless it becomes a little thick and i'll show you which what kind of consistency will be needing i'm cooking it on medium to high flame um the color has also changed a little bit and we have to cook it for another 5 minutes i have been cooking it for uh, 7 to 8 minutes now and continuously stirring it as you can see it has just started to thicken up but still we need to cook it for another 5 to 7 minutes now as you can see it has reduced a lot and total i've cooked it for 15 minutes and we'll cook it for another couple of minutes on high flame but make sure you just completely stir it it has been cooking for another 2 minutes now and i'm going to switch off the flame and we'll stir it at this stage i'm going to add the butter it helps in making the condensed milk more shinier Also I'm going to add half a teaspoon of vanilla essence this is totally optional that's why I did not show in the ingredients this gives a very nice aroma and color but you can always make it without that even and I'm going to let it cool once cooled it is going to thicken more so this kind of a consistency is perfectly all right So I've transferred it to a bowl and let it completely cool. Uh, as you can see, it has got a perfect consistency and a very nice shine. Uh, once completely cool, I'm going to transfer it to a glass bottle or a glass jar, uh, and I'm going to keep it inside the refrigerator. So now it, you have seen it was so easy to prepare condensed milk at home. Just few things you have to keep in mind. First of all regularly stir it while uh, reducing the milk secondly do not over reduce it that means do not over thicken it because once it's cooled down it is going to thicken more and finally uh, store it in some glass jar and keep it into the refrigerator it will last long for about 15 to 20 days but i would prefer or i would suggest you to make it in small batches and just use it fresh I hope you like my video. Please do share it with your friends, family. Also, please do subscribe my YouTube channel. It's completely free, and you'll get a notification whenever I'm going to upload a new video. Uh, for the daily updates, visit my Facebook page, and for the written recipe, visit my blog. I'll mention all the links below in the description box. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon with a new recipe. Till then, bye bye.